Life for a dog in the dog meat trade is ruthless. And these people who are handling them and producing dog meat, they don't even try to do anything humanely. Today, I'd like to pick a dog for a photo shoot to hopefully bring attention to all these amazing dogs and one day get them all adopted. This is footage of oh what gosh. it was like for her to be caught. Oh, it's that is hard to watch. Heart wrenching. You know, they're just crammed in those crates, and in this case, how many dogs are in there? You know, some can have six, seven, eight, and this oh. little dog is just trying to get at a stream of water. Oh God, it's awful. Seeing the video certainly was a wake-up call, like kind of a slap to the face. This is actually happening somewhere in the world. Is the dog meat trade illegal? Yes, in Thailand it's it illegal. illegal. They've done a great job culturally uh -huh. to get people to realize you don't, you know, it's not a good thing to eat dogs. Okay. It's the surrounding countries that it's more prevalent. How do they actually wind up getting here? They fly. They fly. We've yeah. taken in over 200 dogs. How many have found homes? Um, 160. Oh my gosh! <laughs> High five! It's incredible! When Kaylee and I are trying to kind of assess how good they're going to be with our camera equipment, if a dog is really skittish about even meeting a person, it means that the photo shoot's gonna be pretty tough. Oh, hi, Veronica. Look at her tongue. Miss Veronica, you have a face. <laughs> you got one beautiful tooth. You have a snaggly tooth, the most beautiful tooth. Yeah. Man, is she beautiful. Her snaggle is so special. She's been with us for a while, oh, seven wow. months. And her tongue hangs out the side, which I love. It's just a fun accessory that she keeps over there. She ended up having to have some a bunch of her teeth removed due to cavities. That's why her tongue hangs out to the side. It gives her so much character, though. Oh, she's right? so sweet. Look at she just. What a and, love! Yeah. I'm just gonna see what she thinks about treats. Oh, I <laughs> think she likes them. There we go. She has a number of things kind of going against her in terms of. She's a little bit older. She's got a snaggle, which yep. I think is beautiful. But and she's looking she's for quite a, original. a family that's as original and unique as her. I think it would be beautiful to showcase, you know, a dog that isn't perfect looking. Yes, um, let's go, imperfect. Yeah. Like her physical looks are a direct result of what she's been through. And she is just so beautiful. I love her temperament and I feel such a story about her and sort of in her eyes. I, I think that she's the hero that can stand for all these other dogs and tell this, this very big story. What do you think, Veronica? You got it, girl. We have to go meet our commercial client but I would like to come back and really spend some time with Veronica. And just have some bonding time before we get into the big wild photo shoot. Snaggletooth for the win. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, we're gonna make you a star. I really wanna make an amazing photo to showcase Veronica and all the other dogs that the parking lot has rescued from the dog meat trade. But not everything is coming together right now. God, this is a tough balancing act, isn't it? Mm -hmm. She's such a good girl, it's crazy. Okay. You ready? You come on a plane? All the way over from Thailand? Oh, the tongue is out. Oh my God. There we go. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God, what is that? A typical day for us shooting uh, is gonna be a long day. I'm feeling wild, I can't see this hat. Good girl, look at that smile. It's a little too tilty. We're going to shoot and shoot and shoot. I'm so close, I'm so close, I swear. Oh, this is everything. Everything! I feel like I got something. And then when the shoot's over, we're gonna pack up everything <laughs> and we're gonna start to say goodbye. Thank you so much. I'm so glad, grateful this plane shot off. is my dream. <laughs> and then Kaylee's going to see something and we're gonna shoot some more. As the lush reds of light were fading from the sky. Oh, her car. Oh my God. These skies are incredible. I wanted to kind of just snap a few more. And then at that time, because it was getting darker, our lights were showing up, and all of a sudden we were getting those colors that we were dreaming of earlier. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, that's it. That's the composition of my dreams right there. And not only did we get bright, fabulous colors from those flashes, but we grabbed a gallon jug of water, and we spread it all over the ground, and then we got these beautiful reflections coming up from the bottom. Jeez Louise, you are a rock star. And that's what made it, the water. I can't wait to show Stacy the pictures. Good girl! 